Right, Kevin, I'm just going to start this interview with one word, and that is wow. Uh, yeah, that's a good word to describe it. I mean, it was uh, such a topsy-turvy match out there, and from almost being down and out to actually having a few match points of my own and then going into a third set breaker, and <clears throat> yeah, I think that was probably a fitting way you know, at the end to finish that. But uh, I thought I com competed well throughout. I was able to stay composed even you know, when I was down, and you know, matches sometimes are like that. You're not going to win... Uh, most of them but sometimes if you just stay in the moment uh, you give yourself a chance and you know I was able to do that today and come back. Yeah, but how do you, you, you know you're obviously 30 love down and the, you know number four in the world is serving out the match and then also when you when you do get past that mm -hmm. you you have those uh, match points that go away I mean how do you kind of steal yourself in obviously a, a tie break situation again which is also very pressured? Well the 30 love you don't have too many expectations I was just playing the next point and uh, I thought I returned pretty well that game and gave myself a chance and uh, you know he uh, he had a couple of unforced errors and uh, next minute I'm you know back at 5-0 and then I played a really good game to establish that lead again at 6-5 and you know sometimes like that you're able to carry a bit of momentum and I was able to and had those couple opportunities at 6-5 um, but as I said earlier just I felt throughout the match I didn't really think too much I was just really focused in on the moment I thought I did a lot of things well today so I'm very happy with uh, the match and especially the way I played. Yeah, I mean, people talk about you and your serve, but obviously it's quite fitting in the tie break as well. You know, it, was the, it was the return that kind of set up the mini break and then the, that final point itself was, was pretty special as well. Yeah, from uh, early on I thought I played a really good break. I had a really good wide serve at 2-all. I uh, felt I could have been a bit more aggressive on the 3-2 point. I thought that was a mini opportunity that I let slip a little bit, but uh, the next return I'll definitely take that any day of the week to go up 4-3. and. Uh, serve at 5-3 to give myself those three match points and uh, you know I felt I was in a good position there and uh, you know you you're always thinking to yourself let me try get one of these next two points off the return instead of having to serve it out and obviously winning the first point uh, made that a little bit easier on me. And that's your third win over Stan this year I mean you've had a good year I know it's not over yet but um, I mean, how do you kind of look at yourself and appraise how 2014 has gone? Yeah I think there's been some um, you know overall I'm really happy with the year um, you know as always I feel like there's little things I can keep doing better and that's uh, you know part of uh, my approach to the game I'm you know looking at ways to keep improving and getting better um, but you know right here I'm really focused on just competing well and uh, playing the best I can for uh, for each match and uh, you know after this tournament I'll sort of assess the year a little bit more and uh, you know take a little bit break and then you know it's the off season time where you actually get a little chance to work on a few things when you're playing tournament after tournament it's pretty tough to do that you just start there uh, trying to stay healthy and uh, Trying to, I think, trying to com uh, compete well. Well, on paper, your match tomorrow is a tough one for you, but um, I mean, obviously, he's got his own sort of pressures, trying to get to London, and you know, the, the past in some ways doesn't always predict the future. Is that right? Yeah, I mean, that'll be key for me. Just, uh, yeah, I'm mean, gonna approach it like another match. Uh, you know, obviously, I've got a pretty tough record against him. I um, played him quite a few times and haven't been able to break through. But uh, I mean, I'm just looking at it as another match. I mean, it's not going to be any easier because I've played him X amount of times. Um, yeah, it's still going to be a tough match. He's a, he's, he's a great player. He's obviously playing for a lot as well. Um, so I'm going to go out there and play my game, focus on what I need to do, uh, try and maybe, you know, incorporate some of the things. Obviously, I've, I know what to expect against him, but it's, yeah, I mean, I'm definitely going to have to play well.